Kolo man refers to fossilized remains discovered in Kolo Cave, P plus or minus Ablanca, Cagayan, Philippines in 2007 by Armand Salvador Maez. Specifically, the find consisted of a single 61 mm metatarsal which, when dated using uranium series ablation, was found to be about 67,000 years old. As of July 2010, the biological classification of Kolo man is uncertain. The metatarsal bone discovered has been identified as coming from a species of genus Homo, but the exact species classification is uncertain. It has been speculated that Kolo man may be Homo sapiens or Homo floresiensis, though the latter is sometimes considered a pathological specimen of the former. Distinguishing between the two species would require material from the skull or mandible. As of 2012, the team that discovered the bone was seeking permission to search for more bones in the area. Description Although the initial theory of human migration to the Philippines proposed the use of land bridges during the last ice age, modern bathymetric readings of the Mindoro Strait and Subuta Passage suggest that neither would have been fully closed. Therefore, the theory at present is that Kolo Man and his contemporaries in Luzon arrived from Sunderland by raft. The timing of Kolo Man is very roughly contemporaneous with that during which other Sunderlanders are known to have travelled across the more extensive Wallace Line to begin the settlement of New Guinea in Australia. Butchered animal remains were also found in the same layer of sediment, which indicates that the Kolo Man had a degree of knowledge in the use of tools, although no stone tools were found. The bones of the animals were from deer, pigs, and an extinct type of cattle. The lack of stone tools could be explained by the use of organic tools such as bamboo. References